Hello guys, welcome back. So now here in this session, uh, we'll explain another error and solution. Actually, the error is okay. So this is the error. This field uh, would say account assignment is required, and this is BSET. Of course, it's the name of table, guys. BSET, and this is the name of field. Okay, this field I've already checked here. Uh, this is the you know the field name is I think reason code. Okay. Let's have a look when it is taking place. So one of my students is doing this, uh, what do you say, testing for uh, withholding tax. Okay, this is the, okay, this is the company code here. I'll leave a vendor, leave a date here, particular amount, a GL code, amount, Press enter. This is the required entry given. Now, so look at here. This is what the error. So, additional account assignment required for this field. RS uh, TZR. So, this is like what is the name of this field, guys? This is the technical name of uh, I think reason code. I have checked it already. So, it means what is happening? This field is a required entry. Now, so what we have to do? Either you can make it optional. Okay, but the question is like, okay, this line item, right? Line item is being controlled by what guys? Field status variant and posting key. So where to check? Posting key or field status variant? We'll start from field status variant. Always guys, first of all, you have to start from field status variant. If you couldn't find any anything over there, then you can check the posting key also, right? So fields are being controlled by these two. Let me check here. So, now go to OB C4. OB C4 and here C is here on itself. Double click and let me check it. G001, I think, uh, in this GL account. Okay. In this GL account. So I hope he has given this. Uh, so you can check like you can open this GL account and you can check which field status group. Mostly like people are using G001, but still go to FS00 and here you can check which one expense, right? Rent account. So it is G001 itself, right? So you come back here and g001 so reason code where is this reason code guys reason code i think it is coming here under payment transactions look at here this reason code this is a required entry either you can keep it optional or you can keep it suppressed just save it so now the field related so i think this error is solved let me check it This error is solved, guys. I think this is solved. Press enter. Yes, that error is not here, right? Now, but again, another challenge will be there. Now we have to check whether the uh, this uh, what do you say? This one is getting calculated or not? Withholding tax is getting calculated or not? Click on simulate. So TDS is not getting calculated. So this is again another problem. We have to check where is the problem, right? So where is the problem, guys? Now uh, we'll do one thing. So first thing, like I have to check the setting one by one, right? Whatever the minimum basic settings are there for withholding tax, whether it is. But before that, check here withholding tax tab itself. Okay, so here this is appearing in display mode, right? It must be in editable mode, right? It is appearing in display mode. It means again here also field related problem only will be there. Configurations may be fine, but field is suppressed somewhere. Again. So now here what is happening? So G001, right? If you check G001 here, I, I don't think that it will taxes. Everything is fine. G001 is fine. Where we have to check? So look at here, guys. It is appearing here at header level. Now here in this one. 
so generally this is coming from where so this is coming from vendor side right in vendor which uh, vendor master which account we have assigned that is reconciliation account this is a deal account and what is the field status group for that one g067 so we have to check here in g067 field status group double click and look at here taxes double click here so this is suppressed that is why now so this is suppressed now you make it optional and save it and then if you come back here then look at here right now it is in display mode but if you go to every 50 once again and enter the details here You click here withholding tax tab okay every time we forget to specify the page okay look at here now it is it is in a what is a editable mode guys right now if you simulate press enter this is just a notifications now so look at here the tds is getting calculated successfully like it let me post it whether it is getting posted or not now another error is pan not available <laughs> this is another error guys Pan not available means go to what is the vendor number, guys? Let me check it. The vendor number from here. This is the vendor number. So maintain the pan. Go to slash and xk02. And this is the vendor number. Click any address itself. Look at here, guys. The sin detail. This is additional tab which should appear for you people also. Then only you can maintain the pan. If it is not appearing, then you have to activate this. I think OMT3 is the transaction code by which you can activate this. This sin tab. You click here, and here we can specify. Okay, specify a pan detail just save it and then now so once again go to every 50 every 60 so this is how look at here right like two errors has taken place again test I have to test will I have done here press enter it is appearing let me post it yes it got posted so now whatever the errors are there that is solved but anyway the error which i have shown here the first one right that is already it was field related issues and remaining whatever i've covered that is like previous calculation was not happening that is why i've explained so this is what the solution